I saw this question on YouTube. Well, actually, I have several videos of dealing with this kind of uh, questions. Can okay, I don't mind uh, show once again because this method is very good. The quickest way to find x. We know that x, uh, if it's a complex number, you have five roots, and x is equal to a fifth root of a one. Now, how to find a fifth root of one? I'm using unicircle. This is unicircle. The radius is equal to one. And the fifth root, fifth root of one, are five points on this unicircle, and uh, they are equally distance apart. Well, uh, the, the distance along the along the circle, and we know that one is uh, one of the units. One is the unit. It is the it is the fifth root, and the next one will be. Uh, well, let me draw it. this angle is a uh, two pi over five, right? Because this two pi divided by five, and the next one will be. Uh, the next root will be four pi over five, and the next root will be, this is a negative four pi over five, and this root is a negative two pi over five. So we have a five roots, one, two, three, Four and five. These uh, five points are the roots of uh, one, fifth root of one. So this point is a uh, cosine two pi over five plus i sine two pi over five. This point is a cosine four pi over five plus i sine four pi over five. This point, this point is a, a cosine. 4 pi over 5, because negative positive for cosine is the same, minus i sine 4 pi over 5. And this, this point is a cosine 2 pi over 5, negative positive for cosine is the same, minus i sine 2 pi over five. Therefore, all together, we have a five units. So x is equal to for this one. No, x equal to one. That's one of them, and uh, the other two complex roots always in conjugate pair by pair. So this is a cosine. 2 pi over 5 plus or minus i sine 2 pi over 5. And uh, the other two is a uh, cosine 4 pi over 2, 4 over 5 plus or minus, plus or minus i sine. 4.025. Yeah, these are five roots for this equation. Now, this, this method 
is a very, very quick, quickest, the quickest way to find the roots like this. And if you want to prove why, you you can prove very easily by using the Euler's formula, right? I leave it, leave the proof to yourself. And uh, I I have a similar kind of videos on YouTube, you know, to to solve the solve the equation like this by using the unit circle. You you may you may find them, you know. Thank you for your watching.